welcome back to my channel welcome back everybody and if you new welcome 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 i hope you enjoy this video and um yeah i'm sure you read the title today i am going to be um it's like a little haul or whatever just showing y'all what i got because i've ordered um trying to like get the stuff that i need for my makeup so i can start doing better videos and more content and stuff like that so i ordered some stuff and i got some stuff today so i just want to show y'all it is nighttime so excuse my hair rag um so yeah that's what i'm gonna be doing today so before we get into this video y'all go ahead and hit that like button comment down below some video ideas or what y'all want to see anything what you would like to see what you would like to see more of something new anything i'm open to any ideas but um and make sure you hit that subscribe button if not if you're not subscribed already it's the red button right right here it's red right now but once you hit it it's gonna turn gray and then there's gonna be a bell button you should hit that too so you'll be notified when i post so we're just gonna get right into this video and so i went to sephora today because as i've been saying in a couple of my videos i want a foundation that's gonna match my skin like like perfect like i want it to be my favorite foundation i want to find the foundation that i like and to be like excuse my nails also I want to find a foundation that I like so I can be like, oh, this is my favorite foundation. I like the way it feels. Da, 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 da. So I picked up the Born This Way foundation. It is medium to full coverage and I don't wear makeup that often. So I didn't want anything that was going to be too heavy on my face. And I was in the store for a while. I've been going to Sephora like this is my second time going to sephora looking for a foundation and i like swatch the same foundation over and over i was gonna get the finny but then the fenty but then i went to this and i saw this and i wasn't really sure if the finny was matching me because i did get some samples but i wasn't i didn't know so i just tried this and i put it on like half of my face and you could like not tell that it was it was the right color or whatever so I just ended up getting this. I got the color chestnut. I guess I should be putting it back. Maybe I should put it into my makeup thing while I'm taking it out. So I got the color chestnut in the Born This Way. I'm gonna take it out of the box, out of the boxes. And then I wanted to get the shape tape, but it was a Sephora by itself. So like it wasn't like in a mall where most malls have like Sephora and Ulta. Well, the mall that I go to, but has Sephora and Ulta, and the Shape Tape is a Ulta exclusive. So they didn't have it. So I ended up getting the Born This Way a multi-use sculpting concealer also, because they said that was the next, like the closest to the Shape Tape. So I ended up getting this in the color Mocha because I wanted it to be lighter than my foundation. So I got those two. And then uh, next we got some powder. I did have the big one, but then I got up there to the register and I was like, oh, they got mini stuff. Like I had the big, I had the big, um, well, I got the setting powder too, the going this way setting powder, the hangover one in three. I had the big one, but then I got this little one, like, it has the same shelf life, and I can just come back and get it for cheaper, because I don't really use, I'm not really gonna run out of it, unless I start doing makeup, like, a lot, which I plan to, but then I can just go back and get more, so right now, I just got the little, this, this is the setting, setting, prom set, and refresh, so I got that one, and I got the little Laura Mercier, powder the translucent powder and it comes with this little thing but i probably won't use it i'm not sure okay next i got a little beauty blender for up under my eyes for concealer and i got the cleaner because 
when I clean my brushes, I got some, I got some, um, brush cleaner. It should have made it today to the house. But, um, when I clean my brushes and I clean my sponges, my sponges really don't. You see, like, this is clean. I just, I literally just cleaned this. Well, the top part is a little dirty right there. Well, look at this one. This one not as bad, but it has those little stains. So, I got the Beauty Blender cleaner because it's like the little soap. And I can just use that like, for my beauty blenders, beauty blenders or whatever. And I got the NARS primer, the Radiance primer. I've been seeing a lot of stuff on it, so I heard it was good or whatever. And I got the um, I got the Farsali Unicorn Essence drops. They like moisturizer kind of. So I got that. What else? I think that's everything that I got in the store today. So that's everything that I got in the store today. When I went to Sephora. So let's start with this. I got this big box. And this is all from the crayon case. Except you'll see. But this is what the inside looks like. And here is everything that I got. So we're gonna just start. I'm gonna have to put it down here. So let's start with this. First, I got the matte book. The matte book is the palette the macbook palette and if you don't know what the crayon case is like a uh, super scent her, it's her company it's a makeup company and like it's called the crayon case and like all of their stuff is like school related so they made this the macbook to look like a math book so you see all those numbers and then on the side it has a it looks like paper in there but then it's like this because okay she has a palette that's the crayon the box of crayons which is like every color that you would ever well not every color that you would ever think of but every color like all these colors maybe like the crayon box like a crayon box colors I guess but they have shimmers in it too this is all matte shades so you get 3, 6, 9, 12, 15, 18, 20. You get 21 little shades right here. And then at the bottom you have five little neutral brown colors that you could kind of use. You could use that for like contour too. They're big enough. They're like big pans, so there's like big pans of the browns that you can use for like transition colors, and then you have 21 shades up at the top. And I had just had to get it. Like this is the math book, the matte book, like all these matte shades. I really like it. So that's that. I'm gonna put this up while I go through. First, I have to get a thumbnail. Give me a second. Next, we're gonna go with this. I got the contourization notebook. Well, you know you have those contour contourization. They're composition notebooks. You have the composition notebooks in school. So this is the contourization notebook. This is a contour palette. Mm, that's just what it is. It's a contour palette. Cute. next i'm gonna go with this next so the crayon case recently um dropped their their um these lip glosses and these eyeliner pencils they are the Toki, tokyo collab they are lip glosses i'll show y'all what they look like this is the blue one Sure, it's not that blue when it goes on. I'm just gonna swatch my hair on my hand. It smells nice too. 
They smell like cake. Maybe like vanilla or something. Like they have, I don't know. They can't smell like cake. Kinda. Well, that's just clear. Y'all know what clear lip gloss looks like. And these feel, these feel really nice on the lips. They're really smooth. It's just a pink one. I try I had to try one out like I already did like a little unboxing on Instagram on my story but I had to do a video for you guys see that's them swatched just lip gloss or whatever they smell nice so there it was four lip glosses that they did with her and then these liner pens these lip liners no, they're eyeliners, eyeliner pencils. And they're all these different colors. So there's pink, blue, purple, orangish, yellow, uh, red, and green. So those are, and they're like chopsticks in this dark blue. I dropped out. So you got those. Then I got the contour brush. It's a double-sided brush. Gonna open it up. I haven't felt this one. Oh, pretty nice contour brush. Then I got this foundation brush. This I didn't really I didn't have to break that off. There was a little strap on it. This is a foundation brush. I guess whatever. But it feels nice. And I got this angle brush. They said it's um, easy to do your nose contour with. I'm gonna tear all of them. But they said it's easy to do your nose contour with. It's like a big angle brush. If I can get it out, I'll show you. Yeah, that is nice to do your nose contour with. Yes, big angle brush. Then I got these these are the ink pen brushes it's like a flat brush and two blending brushes in there this is the seven count pencil brushes which are like eyeshadow brushes i believe yeah pencil in your eyeshadow that's cute like all their stuff is really cute the way they do it and like the theme they keep the theme and i just like i just love it these are eyeshadow brushes. There's seven of them. They sent me this little angle brush because I really don't remember putting this in my cart. This is the Judy brush, which is really cute. And it's really soft. It's a powder brush. And then this was in there, an angle dual-sided brush, like for your eyebrows. Do side I guess they send that with their um I made because I got some of that too. Um I got the washable eye glue stick, which is eyeshadow primer, which is so cute. It is like the cutest thing ever. They're like they really like I like the way they do that. That looks like a glue stick. Some sponges some sponges I got the um, limey liquid eyeliner this is the black one and then the white one is called white out this is white um, eyeliner so that's what they look like this is the white out and this is the black liner I got a brush cleaner like for your you know clean off M20 eyeshadows I got two packs of loose leaf listen this is like paper loose leaf makeup wipes look how cute it is that is so like unique and cute and then last but not least I got their uh 25 count pigments 
these is 25 pigments. I'm gonna open it for you. Look at all those pigments. There are loose pigments. Let me um get one out. I'm gonna get this one out. This is what they, they come in these little containers. Good bit. It's a good size amount in there. Then they have the little cap in it. I can get it out. Give me a second. And then the cap comes out and it's just loose powder. Like loose pigment. I see. And I bet it's really like. Mm. But I gotta keep those caps on there so it doesn't get messy. But that's just the loose pigment. The little bit they got on my hand. Okay, so put that back. And these are called arts and craft pig pigments. So they're, I guess, they're like paint pots. And okay, the last thing I got is from Mayo Makeup. Yeah, Mayo Makeup. I got their 10 count glitters which is like black this is like a peachy kind of pink this is like a pink well i guess this would be like hot pink this is like a pink orange yellow green dark green blue purple and white and then these are their seven i i don't really know the exact name i guess they're just called brights but these are their seven bright pigments they're their um, like neon colors purple pink that peachy kind of pink well i guess this would be hot pink i don't know which one but which one is hot pink and which one's not but this one they're both kind of like a pink because i thought it was red at first but it's not red it's like a neon this one is like a neon pink and this one is like pink pink um orange yellow green and blue so that's everything that I got. Um, the James Charles brushes come out, come restock tomorrow on Morphe, and I will be ordering those. And is that everything? Yeah, I think that's everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This is everything for this video. I just wanted to show y'all, come and show y'all um, the stuff that I got. And I can't wait to create some um, makeup videos for y'all with all this stuff. Like, I just love new makeup. Like, I love to play in it and stuff. But, it feels like Christmas. But like I was saying, that's the end of this video. I hope y'all liked it. Y'all give this video a big thumbs up. Comment down below what y'all think of the video. Um, if y'all have any of these products, what y'all think of them. If you go get any of them, what y'all think of them. Anything. Um, video ideas. All of it. And subscribe to the channel if not already. And yeah, that's about it. See you in the next video. Thank you for watching.